I'm Jenny. I'm Erin. And we're here for Han Ji Sung's birthday. Oh, Han. Would you. Uh, I'll give you 60 seconds to just gush as much as you can. Six seconds just to say everything you love about him. Three, two, one. God. Okay, I love his cheeks when he eats and his hair when it's dark and when it's blonde and it's any colour. And he has really pretty eyes. And oh, the way he raps, it's just so, oh, the different way he raps. And then there's the way he sings and his voice is so beautiful. And when he's dancing and like when he forgets, it, it's just so adorable. And he's so funny. And his British accent, I love his British accent. So true, true. <sighs> okay, I'm done. You're done? You can say, you can like say it all. Like and I saw a clip oh. where he was being really, really sneaky and getting away with it. And you know how much I appreciate that. That is a life <laughs> skill that I'm proud of how I can do it. So, yeah. Right. And he can write songs oh. and produce songs. <sighs> yeah. All here for loving him. Because what is not to love, but... I just gave you a whole list of reasons. <laughs> I mean, yeah. You could... 13 reasons why I love him. Yeah. <laughs> Could host like some kind of like conversion course or something. <laughs> not that anyone would need converting because it's not a conversion course. It's a cult. <laughs> yes. Yeah. That's. Ooh. Yeah. What would you name your Han cult? Ooh. You have to come back to me on that one. It's got to be a really good name. G Sprung. <laughs> All hands on deck. <laughs> <laughs> yes. <laughs> oh my god! I know it's bad luck to name like a name a boat not after like a woman, but if we ever get a boat, that's what we have to name it. <laughs> it won't matter if it's bad luck because you're not getting me on a boat. <laughs> Buy a book and name it that, please. I beg of you. No, he'll name it after me. It'll be called Jenny. Let yeah. us know what you would call your Han cult. Uh, so, as we do for our, um, I was going to say Bias's birthdays, Bias's records, K pop birthdays. Yeah. Uh, we watch a an MV or just we do a song a solo song or maybe just a song associated with that member in particular and then we do a compilation video so we're going to start with Han's song now is it close or is it close because our wonderful English language has yeah. it spelt exactly the same oh gotta, gotta love the English language haven't you yes it's super helpful so I don't know if it's close or close we will find out well you can't be close to someone if you close yourself off. Ooh. He's, I think he's quite a, like a deep soul. Yeah. And yeah. I know that he's had like maybe some like mental health issues and stuff like that. So I wonder if it's like going to be quite like a play on. Yeah, it could be those kind of words. And he is known for his uh, songwriting where it's quite a important or even sad message, but yeah. in an upbeat song. So, yeah. Has an MV though? <gasps> like a proper all out? I believe so, yeah. I know. Just like a whole MV, just of Han. Yeah. Oh. Maybe I'll just move over here where you can't hit me. I'm not a violent person. Yeah, but I feel like between you and Alex, I'd be murdered. I wouldn't be violent, I'd just remove you from my life in another way. Okay. So, so there's no subs on this one, so maybe we do a lyric video after. Yeah, because otherwise we won't, we won't know. Exactly, and I care about what he says. Yeah, and he's, oh, I feel like this is a dangerous combination for you, it's blonde yet messy hair. Yes, and is that a white shirt, I see. All you need for it to happen now is like you to put a hand through his hair in some angst. Oh yeah. Oh. With a blue sky like in blueprint. Yeah. Mm. And then he pops an eye patch on. Don't. I've seen images of this a whole time when he was wearing an eye patch. I know. I said I think it's for medical reasons, but I'm here for it. 
Not everyone can pull off my patch, you know. <laughs> Han and vocal Han. That was like where the sun's coming up and that's just where the sun's going down. Like the two very different times of day. Love this chorus. You had me at hello. <gasps> so I feel like it's close rather than close. Yeah. And I feel like it's about wanting to get close to someone, do you know, and maybe being scared to do so. I don't know, that's... But then I'm going on the word, using that word and how would that feeling using that word, do you know what I mean? But then close could be as well because like we said you want to get close to yeah. them but if you are closed you can't yeah I, I do feel like there was like the two the two sides maybe because one was more vocal one was more rap yeah, but also there, I, I do feel like they were different like purposefully yeah. different times of day because the sun rise could be like the 
opportunity about okay. getting close to someone yeah. and you know as the night falls you close yourself off because it can be quite a, a dark and difficult time or a scary thing to do yeah and just or even like how you feel at different times of day oh I don't know I, I yeah you didn't give much away or kind of the sunrise bright is the hope and the darker sunset is the doubt yeah the questioning mm. then there are a few shooting stars so even in the night there's hope mm. oh I don't know because I felt know. like the verses were quite thoughtful but the chorus was quite hopeful I think it's always interesting when we have these conversations to then look at the lyrics and see but isn't it interesting because say we are like bang on the money yeah how like how amazing is that that just from a few visuals and his sound yeah he's been able to convey portray, yeah convey yeah. that's the better word convey his message yeah through a language barrier yeah, should we uh, yeah, do a lyric video? video? See whether we are in tune with yeah. Han or whether we are way off. <laughs> I mean, it could go either way. It could. It's a lovely picture. It's quite distracting. The contacts. Although now I'm like, what colour are his eyes? I was just thinking they might be both but they're not I don't know whether he's wearing contacts there or they photoshopped and it makes the eyes look I swear his eyes aren't that brown oh that's not that's I'm looking away hard oh it's about me <laughs> See? There's a lovely sound to it. Yeah. You could nod your way through. Flustered. Oh, I pretend to be bald. the verses is telling a story yeah Down, down, I don't 
makes me like the chorus even more so it's like the chorus are more his doubts yeah and his worry of yeah By really fast so we were on the right track yeah but I felt like we were gonna be like oh yeah it's like an introspective look or something I didn't feel like it was gonna be like an all-out like I want to get to know you yeah yeah and I'm sorry that I'm being if I don't do it now like oh yeah I'll miss the chance like I guess we're not really that used to quite out and out like Love interest songs. in someone yeah yeah i suppose it's that kind of thing that if you see someone in public that if you don't go and talk to them now you may not ever see them again so if you've you know and you said i've never done this before and had that feeling before of have, needing to get to know someone like that do you think that happens to them though because i do feel like sometimes you do just look out and there is just something that just shines in someone and you can't put your finger on it you don't yeah. know what and like you don't even need to have spoken to them you just like it's like a beacon yeah something about someone and that must be awful for them yeah. if that happens and they know that they can't pursue it yeah yeah maybe that's like what he wished he'd done i don't know maybe or it could be a life experience you don't yeah know. You know, they did have a life yeah. before. And I do get the impression that he might be someone who would fumble his words a bit and, you know, maybe say the wrong thing in trying to... Yeah. I, can, so no, I, I think see. everyone will have moments of doing that in situations. But it's so strange to think, isn't it, that... When you see them on stage performing, yeah. I suppose that's choreographed and they they're in a different persona yes I mean I think they have a different version of themselves that is on stage performing and that's why you see them do stuff and then when they watch it back they're like oh my god yeah they're so (laughs) cringing I really love that and it's very different and a different message behind it and it it felt very real. It, yeah, that's what I was going to say. It felt real and vulnerable. I hope that you you're, didn't... You know, you're putting yourself out there. Yeah. Because he even said, didn't he, about, you know, about we know how old are you, you know, you're addressing things. He's like, I'm sorry if I'm being rude and asking all these questions. Because I know that I've done that before, like, on a date. I feel like I've suddenly interviewing them because you ask loads of questions because... You want to know when you want to keep the conversation going. You want to show interest. Yeah. And it's like you want to, you're so fascinated with this person. You want yeah. to consume every bit of knowledge you can. And yeah. people can find that quite like jarring or intimidating. And yeah. you're like, no, I mean it in just like the most like loving yeah. way. Like I am fascinated by you. And if they're not, someone's on a wavelength. And the way you show interest in someone is, you know, you want to know them. So you need to ask questions. Yeah. Ooh, I might have just have a little Google about that song. Yeah. Okay. So, uh, Hans Habits. <laughs> I believe it's by Clown Stray. <laughs> or Clown Stay. There will be a link in the description because we've watched their Habits videos, I think, for each member. We've still got more to go and yeah. uh, they're always good. I'm excited. So, <laughs> yeah, Han. Han's comedian, so I feel like my face is going to hurt. Yep, definitely. But it's fine because we've got some cheesecake to choke on. We do. So we have 
some cheesecake. It's a strawberry swirl cheesecake. Because I'm sure I read somewhere that Han loves cheesecake. Who doesn't like cheesecake? Exactly. Biscuit. Mm. This is this good stuff. Bon, 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 bon. Shrimp looks at Lena like, what the? Song for them too, I think. <laughs> he does live in a musical, as everybody should. You know, he's the person who sits there like putting on my shoes. <laughs> There's a staff member that follows him going, save your voice. this scene yeah I don't have the microphone. <laughs> <laughs> 
<laughs> yeah, by this point, I'd have a mic, a hairbrush, or something. I love how they all just lie on the floor. <laughs> I would never say no, Han. I would never fight you on kisses. <laughs> That's what cheetahs are for. Oh my gosh. <laughs> and like the little glitter around his eyes, he just looks adorable. <laughs> like, I'm jealous. Mm. But she could growing up, we're told not to eat like that. Aren't I we? think I still do. I wouldn't let them eat all in white. No. Me too. <laughs> oh, the little clip in his hair. When people say, "What Disney princess do you want to be?" I always say Sleeping Beauty because I love sleeping. His lips are so pink. Yeah. I feel like he's gonna drop the camera on his face. <laughs> Oh my god, if he left it on and just fell asleep, I would absolutely sit and watch him sleep. Is that creepy? No, I think I'd probably do the same. Ha <laughs> 
Because I know that he's a bit of an introvert. <laughs> I might think introverts with the right people. Yeah. When you're comfortable, that's yeah. how you can. How you can be, and you know, he doesn't need to be on all of the time. No. Oh, that was very fun. <laughs> yeah, my face does hurt. I wonder how he's going to celebrate with cheesecake. With me, yeah. Well, I still have cheesecake left. Oh, the song was obviously about you. It was. He saw me on screen. Yeah, it's true. You'll see it in the comments. However, as you do start every video with "Hi, I'm Jenny," I think we've debunked that because he doesn't need to ask your name if he knows that. I don't want to be too obvious. <laughs> yes. <laughs> <No>. <laughs> I do love him. He's just... He just feels like... Good. Like, whatever situation you're in, he'll be good in that situation. Yeah, he just... I can't think of the right word. He's always going to add value. He's got character. Yeah. Do you know what I mean? I feel like he's the person that who's in the right mood. He'd be brilliant with like ice breaking situations. Like he could, you know, bring yeah. a room of people up if he felt like. Yeah, I feel like you'd never get bored either. Do you know I mean, you could be sat there of an evening, nothing to do. Yeah. But you wouldn't be bored. No, definitely not. <laughs> and like I said, it's like he when so we love watching musicals and i know many people through my life who have said but it's not realistic people don't just burst into song over every living thing they've not been i have been known us. i've been known to do it and han is one of those people who i believe lives in a musical like i said i can imagine him being there, like i'm putting on my shoe yeah he'd fit just, right into our like yeah weird musical lifestyle yeah either i'm singing about what i'm doing or i'm singing a song that relates Absolutely. <laughs> Happy birthday, Hal. Happy birthday. Wherever you are, have a lovely day and eat lots and just have fun. And sing about it. Sing about it. <laughs> yeah. And sleep lots because sleep, sleep is good. the best. Sleep is good. <laughs> he can reach you in his dreams. Not nightmares, dreams. <laughs> Debate. <laughs> Either way, I'll take it. <laughs> so thanks for watching and we'll see you on the next one. Bye. Bye.